CIA frame, help. I am forced to use this method to reach as many persons as is possible with just one action. The CIA is aggressively harassing me wherever I am, sometimes with violence. I am disabled due to an accident that caused second and third degree burns on 40% of my body. The CIA attempts to frame me with individuals timing my entrance and exit from almost every place I go, including my home. A number of individuals and vehicles, many black SUVs, quickly join those already in the establishment I am visiting. I video record these events. The security cameras of those establishments should support me. I have the impression, though, that there are individuals impersonating me as well, some mimicking my path a few minutes after I pass by. Every recording device carried by me has been impaired one by one. At some point, I'll no longer be able to prove this stalking. The CIA deploys very potent chemicals into my residence 24-7 and some areas I visit. I have evidence about the presence of chemicals and the use of very potent electrical bursts at my home to break my sleep in small sections. The bursts leave prints on my wireless night vision video cameras and their recording software. The CIA has set up a 24-7 continuous surveillance of this street and sensors to detect the electrical bursts and toxins daily employed at my home. This agency has spies in every institution, public and private. They will discredit me from the start. They may say, I, I will help this guy. Don't worry. Don't pay attention. Keep yourself involved. Most of my calls are redirected to a CIA call center or to individuals trusted by this agency. I carry with me sets of disks containing evidence supporting most of my assertions. Everywhere else, the CIA stages ambush after ambush in sync with a number of patrols. FDNY heavily involved, 9-11-28-33. The wrecking of my home and major distracting events across the city, nationwide and abroad, remains a strong possibility. In spite of all precautions, the agency keeps breaking into my home. I cannot understand why Mr. Christie, Mr. Cuomo, and Mr. Bloomberg would authorize or allow, under their noses, these CIA operations against the innocent. 10-20-13. Alexander de Forbes.